Chase, we're going to battle on this one. Now, not Hold like not. Draymond Green. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I feel like Draymond today. The way I you went to James. private school. Everybody calm down. Oh. Everybody calm oh. down. Uh, Shady, James, Joy, yeah. Draymond Green was out of line. Yeah. Completely out of line. I think so. He crossed the line. Oh. Uh, oh. Draymond continues to feel like he has to prove his toughness when nobody has ever questioned it. And I hate when people are that questioning of themselves that they feel like they got to prove something to you when you didn't ask him a question. See, what Draymond Green needs is not an ejection. He doesn't need to prove anything of himself. He need therapy. Mm. Need therapy. Mm. Get rid of all them anger issues. Exercise them demons. How long are we going to continue to praise unnecessary mm -hmm. aggression? Yeah. Necessary aggression, I'm with that. But unnecessary aggression, stepping on Sabonis in the playoffs. Mm -hmm. Unnecessary aggression, kicking, hitting LeBron James with a sun, a sun no shine. Unnecessary aggression, putting Rudy Gobert in a chokehold and Rudy right. Gobert just innocently trying to break up a little scuffle that's nonsensical. That's right. How long will we praise <laughs> unnecessary aggression? Because we've seen it transcend the basketball court into the dude's actual life. Mm. So I'm not going to continue to praise the aggression because they put a dude in a chokehold. Ooh, big bad wolf Draymond Green came around the corner. Right. I'm not with it. I'm not with it, James. He crossed the line. What in the world do you got to say? Well, we're just talking this situation, right? We ain't talking about the past situations and what happened in the past situations. That's but I got it. two right boys. Here. I got two boys. They're 10 and 12. Yes, sir. And I tell them both. What you You see me? your brother in a scuffle. Uh-oh. You run over there, you start swinging, and you don't ask no questions till it's over. Ooh. What happened? All right? And then you figure out what happened. But you go over there, you protect your brother, and you start right. swinging. And after that, you ask what's happened. You get in trouble, daddy pick you up, we go get ice cream. That's all right. right? But you protect each other. <laughs> this is all this is. This is the big bro for the Warriors. This is the dude that protects everybody on that floor. So when Draymond sees his brother Clay Thompson in a scuffle, I don't care about nothing else. The first person I see in white is about to get it. Get over and here. we heard some little stuff that he don't like Rudy anyway, so it, it could have been a bunch of dudes in white. He <laughs> got out Rudy, all right? But at the end of the day, this is your teammate. You don't know what's going on. You don't know if he started it. You don't know what happened, all right? But I see a scuffle. I'm going over there to protect my brother. Point blank, period. I don't have a problem with this by Draymond Green. I don't care what happened in the past. Right. You see your brother in a scuffle, you go out there swinging. If I see any of y'all in a scuffle, I'm going in there swinging, and I will ask what happened when it's all said and done. That's it. Jay? <laughs> Sugar. Um, yeah, we, 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 we'll figure out what happened, who started 100%. it afterwards. This is what Draymond is. This is what he's always been. This is the brilliance of Draymond, and you have to take the good with the bad. That's what it is with Draymond Green. The reason that they have those championships is because they got that. They need that dog. And like James said, I can't see. This just, I just got to grab a white jersey. And if it's the biggest one, I got to go after the big, I'm the big dog. I got to get the big dog off my dog. That's just what it is. I'm asking questions later. We will figure out who started it. I will decide if you were wrong well after the nerves have settled down. This is what it is with Draymond. I'm doing the exact same thing. I cannot sit here and persecute him. I am not an anti-violent person. I, I think sometimes you gotta be violent. And in this situation, was it, was it too far? Is he get ejected? Is it against the rules? Of course. You turn on any 90s basketball game, you're gonna see this three times a game. <laughs> now, the, the game has changed, obviously, but this is a part of basketball as well. This is a part of the, this is a part of basketball. This is a part of the game. What we is have, this? We what have is this, this you're referencing that's a part of basketball? If you get in a scuffle and we get in a little uh, kerfuffle, you better do something. You better be over there. Don't be standing on the sideline while, while staying away. I don't want to get involved in it. Ask questions later. That's just this is part of it. I love every bit of it. <laughs> Money Green, that's my boy, Draymond Green. Actually, we are friends. We are cool. He sent me a couple jerseys. But anyway, when you look at when you look at the Warriors and you think of the Warriors, you think of them as aggressive? No, no right? Jump shooters, yeah. right? You play basketball at any time? Why are you hoop, right? Mm -hmm. When you play a team that is jump shooters, mm -hmm. the, the coach gonna tell you to do what to him? You be physical to him. Bully him. If there's not a Draymond Green with the Warriors, right? Because he don't have a lot of big stat lines. He's not gonna shoot a whole bunch of threes. He's not gonna be a scorer, right? He's, he's a physical presence. And when Draymond's there, you can see the, see the toughness. I'm not saying Clay's not tough. I'm not saying Steph Curry's not tough. I just think that the, the way you guard them and play them, you wanna be physical to them. And Draymond is the physical part. You wanna do it to my boy? Cool, I'm here. And the good thing I like about this whole, whole thing about defending your teammate, 
He didn't go for the little guy. No. Mm. <laughs> he seen a seven footer mm. go after his boy. Yeah. Now the thing is, if you really know the Warriors, you know that Steph Curry is obviously Draymond's boy, but his man is Clay Thompson. Yeah. And he see Rudy grab his homie by the neck. Oh. <laughs> that's all. It, that's all it took. He choked him out. Yo, my man, look, calm down. And then I want to give you some credit. He didn't really like hurt him bad. Mm. He just had enough to get him out the way. Yeah. See, I know you don't like that type of stuff, right? But when you're playing sports, it's a physical game. And the weak don't survive. Yeah. They really don't. You ask an alpha men, right, that they work out all the time, that are alphas, I'm better than you, you better than me, let's find out. And sometimes it gets chippy. Yeah. If you watch a little play with him and Clay, it was small. He went for a shot, he kind of pushed him a little bit, he pushed him back, now it's on. Yeah. My thing is, if you're my teammate and we go to war with each other every day, People don't understand, especially like fans. Mm -hmm. I spend more time with my teammates than I do with my family. Yeah. And you think you're gonna harm my family? I'm not gonna do nothing about it. Yeah. Yeah. You got you got one through tripping, <laughs> and that's what he did. He handled his business, and I love it. Acho, real quick, that's you. It happens on the court. What would you want Draymond Green to do right what now? Would you, what would you want me to do? <laughs> Separate it. Separate it. I don't need you to put. I don't need you to drag no dude. Put him. In. Separate it. Like what Colbert was doing. Separate it. You're asking, you're asking that to that apply to reason to an unreasonable situation. I'm a reasonable person. So of you course are a reasonable that. person. We are not reasonable people. But we are all people that are active. If it's on, it's on. Here's, here's, here's my thought process. And it's, it's very, very simple. You said something that was very intelligent. You said, Draymond has always been like this. I'm just very curious. When does somebody mature? I, no, 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 I, I would no. never, I would never want to make a statement. Well, Emmanuel's always been like this. I would hope that Emmanuel at 21 isn't the same Emmanuel at 33. But if the, Emmanuel at 21 was the reason why you are successful, is with the reason why you're in the building. You can't lose that. You don't lose it, no, but you no. figure out how to capitalize on the good no, without no. It, and lose the you're bad. You're asking all him that, to though. be emotional. You're asking him to be professional. You're, no, you're asking him to provide something that is untamed. No. You it, 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 is an instinctual, it is an instinctual thing. That's why when we call somebody that, you know that you can tap into that. But you either you, have that in you or you don't. You you need, he's not acting. You need dudes like this on your team. Point blank, period. Football, basketball, soccer, whatever. You Hockey. need dudes like this on your team. You like Trent Williams? When he show Ooh. up. Ain't too many people. You love that, right? You just told you. You, you, you got what I'm saying. Because they know Trent is about that. They know Trent is about to come protect his brother. Here's my thought process. Point What's your thought process? I'm about to hear this. <laughs> At what point do you realize it's to your detriment? Because what I su could suggest is Draymond Green has caught, and I just hope that y'all would listen long enough to engage in a conversation. <laughs> because I can already see the eyes rolling. I'm just, I would suggest that Draymond Green has cost the Warriors as many championships because of this same attitude as he's won them. Because we know that the Warriors have won themselves four. But I would suggest 2016, many people say if Draymond didn't get suspended, they would have won. I would also suggest if not for Draymond Green's temperament, Kevin Durant would likely still be there. Say Kevin Durant isn't there. I would suggest that if not for Draymond Green's temperament, the Warriors may have had a shot again to at least advance to the conference finals last year. Maybe not the NBA finals, but a minimum the conference finals. You can't win the lotto unless you buy a ticket. So as many championships as the Warriors have won yeah. because of his temperament, well, I would also suggest how many that they, would they have won? Many. Yeah, and if how they, many would they have won without it? I, I'm a believer After in 2016, Steph they lost. They would have got Kevin I'm, Durant. I'm a believer in Steph Curry. So I say I'm biased because I'm a believer in Steph Curry. I believe that Steph Curry is a primary conduit. Steph, Steph, Curry, Steph, Steph plays, Curry's getting rebounds. He's playing under the basket. He only plays one part of the game. He's, he's the offensive shooter and all that. But you need... See, this is the thing, man. When you build a team up, and I guess that we've never been like GMs and all that, but when they build a team, you ever notice that, man... You got a, a lot of guys like a certain way. Mm -hmm. You got a couple of dudes that's different. That's different. Why do you think that is? You need, you need some grit. You need some attitude. Need they all the good teams. You got to have somebody that's scrappy. Mm -hmm. Somebody's going to do the dirty work. That's why the Clippers ain't going to be good. They don't have you know who do he gets compared work. to a lot? Dennis Rodman. Why do they compare him to Dennis Rodman? Jordan, Jordan loves him. Of they have no he offensive did. game. <laughs> no. He gets compared to Dennis. He doesn't need to have an offensive game. He's not there for that. And, he, and I would argue that he does because re offensive rebounds do count for the offense. That's that that is an important part of the game. Robin would get those. Draymond gets those. Rebounding is also an essential, essential yeah, statistic. All four of those that he gets the game. He doesn't need to be the offense. You five have Steph chips. Curry you and Klay Thompson. He doesn't need to do that. Dennis Robin wasn't there to do that. One of the, you, you brought up having these guys on these teams, Indeed. right? You Championship teams also have something important called roles. And if you play your role to the best of your ability, you don't need to be this. You don't need to be that. You don't need to be outside taking shots 
40 foot. What, what in the hell is Draymond Green taking a 40 foot shot for when you have Steph Curry on the floor? He's not there for that because Draymond can't do what Steph does and Steph can't do what Draymond does. It's a team game. And, and, and the reason he's compared to Robbins because Robin was also had this, had an uncontrollable thing man. about him. But without him, they don't win those chips. If Anthony, if Anthony Davis had 25% of Draymond Green and him, oh my God, he would be unstoppable. He'll be unstoppable. But, but He'll be unstoppable. But not only this, I know, I know what Draymond, Draymond's doing raises a lot of eyebrows to a lot of people. Not but at me. the same time, that's, that's what Draymond is, and that's what Draymond is to this team. And it's kind of just like when Steph Curry or Klay Thompson throws up a crazy shot, right? They're the best three-point shooters that we ever see. You're going to take those crazy ones they throw up backwards. You understand what I'm saying? With Draymond Green, hey, we want you to chill. But we know this is in you, and we're going to take that other stuff that come with you because you do bring the dog out of this team. And you need those dudes on your team. Every team that I've been a part of, had, we've had those dogs that you could point out. Who you want to go in the alley with, JJ? Boom, 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 boom. You need them dudes. Yeah. You ain't pointing at all the other dudes over here that you ain't think going to drop in there. Hey, hey, Rob. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I say you this need them dudes. What so alley like, are we going it into, don't JJ? Matter. Oh, oh, it I hate, I hate it matter. Matter. Steve, I, Steve Kerr is the head coach, and he's been through... <laughs> He's been through a lot, right? From even his plan days to coaching. And the last time Draymond got in trouble, he said, he said, um, he said, I'm okay with that. He said, because I know what, who Draymond is. And for this team, we need that. Now, sometimes he can go a little overboard, but I'm willing to take the overboard because I know what he, bring, what he brings and the heart that he has for this team. And if we don't have him, we can't win games. Because if you look at this numbers, you would say, why do they keep Draymond Green? It's because of this type of stuff. Like, he has the heart. When you talk about shooting them crazy shots, I've seen Draymond... Go to step, yo. Why we shooting that? Yeah. He keeps everybody accountable, even Kevin Durant. That's one thing I love about Draymond Green. It don't matter how big the star is, big or small, he's going to keep everybody accountable. Now, sometimes, you know, he might keep accountable where you might get punched in the face for saying the wrong thing, or you might get choked out for doing the wrong thing. But at the end of the day, as a, as a brotherhood in sports, and you know this, you need guys like that to need keep it. everybody in line. I just don't think you need that. Do you need some of what yeah, well, Draymond Green brings? That's going to get, get you championships. That's, that's going to get them suspended. Okay, the well. like, yeah, it also got them championships, though. Because yeah. we, can, we can say whatever we want, but what happened, happened. That's why hypotheticals All day. are That are, check are is cash, bro. Correct. Yeah, yeah, that's that's in cement. It happened, and right. he was that way then, and they won those championships, and he's this way now. Mm. But, so, so we can say maybe they would have won him. Maybe. But right. what we do know is that he was there, he was this way, and they did. And they lost, too. They did. They, they also won. They're up three one. They also won. Hey, are you with the win? Hey, they're up three they also the won. Why does the hypothetical oh, yeah. matter to you? Why does the hypothetical matter to you more than the reality? It doesn't. The hypo the, I'm speaking both realities. The reality is they've won four chips. Yes. Four of them. The reality also is Draymond Green got suspended in 2016. It really cost him. Draymond Green ran Kevin Durant out of there. It really cost him. Draymond Green ruined the chemistry between the Jordan Poe era. It really cost it him. Also, it also reality. benefited them. So it's, it's, all, it's all bad with you, huh? You no. say, so, so, okay, so... I oh, just said they won four championships. So... That's so, great. I, really? What's how better? Is that, what is that? How, how, so what, 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 yeah, how is that well, mountain... Uh, what, like, why are we arguing for the hypothetical of what might have been when we have the proof of what is. Hey, hold on, hold on real quick. Win yeah. four championships. And Draymond watching this too, hold by the way. Hold on real quick. He's watching this too. Hold on real quick. Win four Lord championships, lose four championships, lose a regular season game, win a playoff game. My brother in the scuffle, I'm scuffling. <laughs> Point blank, period. I don't care what it is. I'm in there. That's it. I and that's what this situation I is. I won't cause any scuffle. <laughs> so you ain't got to worry about me. If I, get, if I get into it, because now this is the thing about TV now. Now, we do talk a lot about a lot of people, right? And you say some wild stuff about people. So if, if we see them... We have experience. You see that person and things go down, like, you going go in the car and I'm breaking the scuffle. We've been there. I'm breaking it no, up. I'm talking, about like, I'm talking about real, like, grabbing and all that. I'm keeping the scuffle from occurring. We've been there. So hold on, hold on. If so, is, we've been in the tunnel so, before. No, 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 no. We've been in the tunnel. No, 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 He got hands on Shady. Yeah, it's a man and guy. Not no, yep, yep. We hands, not words, but hands. I'm grabbing him like, what? Let me in. Did we get into it? I'm getting in there. But I'm not letting it get there, though. Like, I don't have time for this. You don't even have You don't know if it's going to get there. This is Moses. Make a walk. I'm going to talk to him. Crazy. Hey, y'all not boy. You bad, you bad, you bad, boy. You... Oh, boy, have you on my thing. This boy said he gonna talk and stop it. What? He's gonna pray over him. Y'all, y'all, let's have a word. Young brothers, have a word, young brothers. 
Oh, he gonna man. stop it. Oh, <laughs> what is going on on this show? <laughs> Subscribe here to get the latest from Speak and go watch a few segments from our other shows on FS1.